Okay, we'll then move on to sketching our gauges. First, make sure that you are in the XY plane view by clicking on the Z line right here. And with plane 4 selected, click on New Sketch located in the toolbar. And next, click on Sketching. You will see that you are correctly editing Sketch 1, which uses Plane 4, as shown here. The problem statement specifies that we want the rosette to be located along the top edge at the middle of the crank. So we'll start by zooming on this area. There are many different ways to draw the gauges using different tools and so on. I found the method that I will be showing you to be quite effective, but it's by no means the only way to do this. So we'll start by drawing our first gauge using the rectangle by three points tool located in the draw menu. This tool is useful for drawing rectangles that are not perfectly horizontal or perfectly vertical. As the name of this tool mentions, you'll click three times to draw the rectangle. Make sure that you draw it slightly slanted, as I did. And quick tip, Ansys actually tells you how to use all the sketching tools right here. So refer to this text if you're ever unsure about how to use a particular tool. Next, we'll give it proper dimension. In the dimensions menu, make sure that general is selected. Then go to the gauge and click on an edge. Move your mouse a bit, click once more, and do this for the edge next to it as well. Referring back to the problem statement, each gauges are 0 0.063 inches wide and 0 0.083 inches long. Let's input those values in the details view window for the respective edges.